We will be. Baby, stop. Why are you doing this to us? I thought we agreed you're going to slow down with this. Why are you doing this? Why? Violent. I stood there for some minutes knocking. You wouldn't even hear me. How can you hear me when you're engrossed with this? <laughs> wow. Please stop. Stop. Benjamin, stop. This is not good for your health. You're killing yourself. You're killing us. Stop. I don't even stand it. Huh? Okay, I'm sorry. You're walking to my house. No respect for me. They tell me one of you. I said I am How sorry. How dare you talk to me? Show me here when I said I'm sorry. I'm sorry, my soul. Jesus! 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 God! 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 Huh? I said I'm sorry! I said I'm sorry. Don't do this to me. Jesus! Jesus! How dare you talk about it? I'm sorry. In my I, good house? I, I, I did not. I'm sorry. No one will ever make me go back to her. I'm waiting for that person that will come and talk to me about tolerance and patience. I'm waiting for that person. Because this act of business is going to become the punch bag. Oh, really? Maybe you talk and see if you don't need that. I don't care anymore. I don't care. If that love her so much that he doesn't give a little about my security, he should go and become the punch bag. I'm done. Honestly, I don't know You claim the loss of that and you can't even like do anything to make sure that the person you love is happy. And all you do is to choose cocaine over your fiancé. Who does that? Jane, you have nothing to worry about. It's all good. If the season has been, you cut my legs with your glass. Right, sir. Hmm. Really? What Oh really, you I know. Mm. You'll still be the one to stop seeing your heart. Don't think that you love me so much. I don't do without him. You, you care of not anymore. Not anymore. Mm. Get something for us. Baby girl, I am not in that mood. Because I can't have my daughter's car brought to me only in the name of marriage. Mom, this was what you did before. And Sam nearly 14. Why he kills the sister? Oh, really? Okay, let me inform you. King says she is not going back there ever again. So make arrangements, go bring back her things from that boy's house. What is all this? No, to know what? Tell me to what end? What else do you want to verify? The evidences of your daughter's body should be enough evidence and proof for you. Chief, please and please do not go there and mess up things for us. Allow me to handle this woman. Allow me. Handle it fast. Dad, I support mom on this so.
still. You know the Bible that brings me whenever I come to your house. Hmm? You see this money and the wine inside. Everything is for you. As a responsible man, I know how to take care of my supposed father in law. So it is my responsibility to take good care of you. To make sure that you are okay, your household is okay as well. You see, I have this complaint. Yeah. So Chief, something is bothering me. As a matter of fact, I can no longer concentrate. Your daughter, the love of my life, I don't know where she is. For the past three days now, I've been calling her. She no longer takes my call, nor returns the calls. Even the text messages, she doesn't reply. I'm bothered. I am missing my love. So I'm here to know what's up. What is going on? The new all these are for me. And there are more from where this is coming from. <laughs> you see the reason? Telling everybody who has to miss them, you are a good man. You see, you are a good man, but my family will not understand. Yeah. And, you see, I told them that Conditions can turn a man around for bad. You are not a bad man, but the situation in the country today can make someone appear bad. That's why I love you so much, because you are a reasonable man. You reason like a matured man that you are. That is why I always come to you. To explain all these kind of things. Chief, I love your daughter so much, no doubt. Honestly speaking, I don't know what came over me that very day I laid my hand on her. I was so mad, I had issues at work. So I got home that very day, I was doing my stuff normally and she just packs in like that and Ben are you are you serious? Are you serious right now? Oh Ben are you serious? Are you kidding me? So this is what you have to say to my father for using his daughter as a punching bag. You sit here and cap rubbish. If you know what is good for your heartless heart, take this money and this drink out of my father's compound. Hey, stop that. No father I will not stop it. And I am totally disappointed at you. If you don't care enough about my welfare, about my security, if all you give a hoot about is your selfish interest, I will fight for myself. I will not stop. So this is all you have to do. Sit here and listen to him tell you rubbish. How he's using your own daughter as punching bag. Is that all you have to do, Dad? I insist that you should stop all this rabbit. They are not necessary. I cannot. I cannot sit here as a man and allow you insult a man, your husband, in my presence. It is never done. Remember that there is always tomorrow. Hey, 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 no, Dad, don't tell me that. I need to be alive today before I can talk about tomorrow. It's only the, the people who are living that talks about tomorrow. If I'm dead, I can't talk about tomorrow. This monster here is capable of sending me to an early grave and I won't let that happen. Please, I am warning you. Take these things out of this place. Oh. Take them out. We don't need them. Why? Take them out. Why? Take them out. If I come back here and meet you, you won't like me. Oh. Oh. My love. Don't mind me. You know how these children, children of nowadays, they will always run da, 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 da. We have to think in deep. Eh? I don't know. Yeah. I not, I'm not mad. I mean, is my wife to be like you said and my husband so the thing is i will just lay low obviously she is smart you know but everything will be fine again. so i beg to take my leave right now so i can just go home and cool up i'm happy i've seen her 
was fine. I'm okay. Thank you for your understanding. It was very much of my so, Chief, uh, yes, I'll call you once again. See you from other time. Avera claims we have a bright future together. But I guess that's because we helped him in getting to federal contracts. And he made a new leg. For me, it's not about his wealth. <laughs> Did you listen to yourself? We're talking about you and not your father. If anything should happen to you tomorrow, you have yourself to blame. Can't you see? Oh, who am I? I wouldn't want to say much, so I don't interfere in your family's matter. But, baby girl, your happiness should come first. And that should be your priority, and not the other way around. Hmm. Jenny, thank you so much. I appreciate your concern. Confused. I don't know what to do. Ben is not giving me breathing space to even go out there and see if I can mingle, probably meet someone else and fall in love. My father is not helping issues. Kim. Yes. I'm tired. He's restricting my movement. Everything. Kim. No woman should be seeing what you are seeing. Gosh. Like, what are you seeing? Nobody, no woman should ever say what you are seeing. Are you in a cage? Did they tie your hands and legs that you can move around? I will only advise you not to rush into my revenge. Make sure he is what you want and you're ready so that you won't regret tomorrow. Hi. I did go small, small. I don't know. 
find this evil man that could have trapped someone and kidnapping my son. What are you talking about? Did anyone come for ransom? Come on. Come now. Oh, Dad. Mabel. Mabel. You're here. Yes. Wait, so, when you call me, we're so urgent that my husband and I feared something must have happened to my brother. How do we know when we don't know his whereabouts? That's the issue. Uh, Mabel. How could your brother leave the company and trust it in his hands as a company manager and just, just like that? Are you not sensing foul play? I will go to that company to accept it. And if by the time I get to that company and they are not giving me the right thing I need to know, I will get the whole management arrested so they could tell me what happened to myself. You're right about that, Father. Yeah. Get the police involved to smell any foul play. Someone in that office can get him out in order to play a fast one on us as mother is worrying about other companies. I don't need to advise you, Father, on what to do. You know his capability. I don't know. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> she tells her, going to your company to raise boss is not advice. Don't just go there and accuse them of what they know nothing about. And if you must go, please tread the caution. Reverend Featherman, she feels it. If you are telling me that my son did not come here to let you know where he was going, why are you insisting that I must not go to my company to make a rest of my staff to ascertain the truth? If you can trust me, she feels that you don't go to your company with police to arrest him. It's better you make inquiries first. But Ben has accepted everything you wanted and swore. What else do you want? I want him to put it in writing and get a lawyer to sign it. Kimberly? Yes, Mom. Yes, I'm just trying to be alive for you all. I understand what you're trying to do, but to me, it, it, it looks like you are trying to catch a man, preventing him from raising his hand on you anytime you go wrong, thereby giving you the right to do wrong at any point in time without anybody questioning you. That's why I say it. Mom, Did I say anything wrong here? Chief. The way that came out wasn't right at all. It sounded as if you're encouraging Ben to mistreat your daughter, to hit her at every slightest provocation, whether she does wrong or not. Bah! He should hit. That is what you exactly portrayed. Well, why are we even beating around the bush? Do whatever suits you. You are an adult. But just know that all I'm concerned is I want you to have a better life, you and your children. That's all. Your mother chose me because she wants a better life. Mom, did you hear that? Dad, listen, I'm not trying to be difficult. I just want to have a happy home, a peaceful marriage. I wouldn't want to get married and I'll start calling you and mom every minute of the day to come sort issues for my husband and I. I wouldn't want that. If I can't have control over all of this right now, when do you think I would? Is it when I must have had three kids or probably when he, had, he must have strangled me to death? Please. Kim, I understand everything you are trying to say. Vividly, I understand you. But your father here is making matters worse. He doesn't even want to understand what we are saying. He's not helping matters at all. Mom, make your husband to understand. I just want Ben to put everything to writing. Get a lawyer to sign it. I'll watch him for a while before I agree to finally walk down the aisle with him. Forever is too long to be sad and miserable. Please, 
Timothy has been calling the company. He has maintained the routine calls, you know, running the company from his unknown destination. Then where is my son? Where is my son? And the number is called. A secure line that he cannot trace. I don't know what is happening to Timothy. I don't know why it's happening to him. The Reverend Father, you went to see. What about him? Hmm. They sound so well, like he knows what's going on. Ah, no. He can't know what is going on and let us go through a much more I will see him tomorrow. Sit yourself. But believe me, you will not get anything. Thank you, cousin, to know anything. Yes. This world we are now, mm -hmm. no woman wants to suffer. Oh yes, no woman will accept you the way you are now and agree to marry you. Listen, first of all, you need to get an apartment. Yes, you need to get an apartment. At least try to be a little bit comfortable, just the way we are enjoying now. Because why? Women like privacy. She need a place she can at least visit once in a while. Why building the relationship? Uh, Joe, just just hold it right there. I, I I understand you're indirectly trying to say that if I find a woman, I cannot bring her to your house. Come on, Timothy. Don't be a bad air with bad order to spoil this air we are breathing in this conversation. So let me ask you. If somebody tells you that I, Joe, could do such a thing, you believe the person? Not that. Then what? Look, I understand everything you said. And I appreciate the fact that you boldly told me the truth as my friend. But I have a plan. Everyone does. Except my plan fails and my hope shatters. But before then, I'll stick to my plan. My brother, your plans will not fail. As a matter of fact, this house is your house. Okay? <laughs> Listen, my prayer is that one day that God will invite us. Amen. <laughs> Baby girl, Ben bought so many things to ask for forgiveness. Wow. Yes, he bought me some clothes, shoes, bags. He even said um, he would take me to the jewelry shop so I can select some things just to make up. That's really good. I'm so happy for you, girlfriend. Once you're happy, that's all that matters to me. I pray he changes. <laughs> then again, I would want you to come along when I'm going to the jewelry shop. Please. Mm, no. Join us. Why? I want. You guys need your privacy. And moreover, I have someone coming to the house today. So just go and drop me off. Then you go and join him. I don't <laughs> like you again. Listen, Joe. All I want is a woman that would love me for who I am. Not because of what I have. And I don't want to say it's not possible before you attack me again. Anything is possible under the sun. But it is one in a million. Exactly. That one shot is all I need to make it right. And listen, my friend Timothy. Please. Please and please. I don't want women to play with your emotion when they realize this is what you want. You know that saying, all that girl does is not good. I swear. If anyone does not listen to your advice, based on your experience with women. That person is done for in this life if they fall a victim. And I will not associate with such person when the time comes. 
because I knew what I passed through in the hands of women. And that is why I commit everything into God's hands. I swear, I am relying on God, honestly. I need to learn this skill more so that I can start using the designs I've been downloading from the internet. Huh? All you need is to focus. Put all your mind and energy. I think I'm trying. Of course, yes. Just imagine if you have started this at your tender age. Maybe by now. And I'll be coming here again. But I thought that going to school was the best option. Until my uncle's wife accused me of rape. Whereas she was the one that lured me to sleep with her. Stop. Stop reminding me of that incident. It makes me sick. Do you know what it means that my son slept with my brother's wife? God forbid. I don't worry. As long as my redeemer leaves us. I will fulfill my destiny. Yes. You must fulfill your glorious destiny. With what I saw you do now, I know you will be looking for me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Now, I can slant it. This is sweet. Um, so, Timothy, hmm? I want to ask you something. Shoot. It's about what you told me. Mm. How do you intend to achieve the plan? Are you sure it's going to work? Hmm. Joe. First of all, nobody plans to fail. And secondly, my plan is going to work. It must work. No. How do you intend to go about it? Because mainly it requires enough money. Timothy, if assisting you means helping you with money, then it's not going to be possible. You know what I'm going through. Eh? Sending every penny that comes into my hand for my sick mother in the village. You know now. Look, I'm not talking about you helping me out with money. It's my cross. I'll carry it. But, um, I just... I mean, you should make the most of it. So, what are you insinuating? I'm insinuating that I would need your advice, your guideline, and I'll need you to stand with me. That's all. Moral support. Mm. Then you have it. I will be there to support you. Huh. Maybe support. <laughs> now this 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 chicken is sweet. Yeah. Mm. Mm. 
don't ever listen to me. There's something I want to tell you. And I would it? want you to keep it to yourself. What is it? Did anything happen? Mom, it's about Ben. I can't do forever with him. Can you lower your voice? So that they don't hear you. What are you talking about? What did he do? Mom, could you believe that Ben is into drugs? He's a drug dealer. Shh, that's not true. How is that possible? He doesn't look it at all. Have you seen a drug dealer before, Mom? How do they look? No, what I'm saying is that he doesn't look like one. What did he do that made you conclude he's a drug dealer? Did any other thing happen? Mom, countless times I've seen cocaine in his closet. Yes, the kind of friends he keeps, the call he makes. None of this shows he's into government contracts like he stated. I'm no longer a child, Mom. You know your father said he made some kind of background investigation of him and verified he is genuine. And even getting us contracts, that could also be a cover up. Don't you think so? Oh, oh, you know what? I just want you to be careful. Don't behave as if, as if you told me anything. Let's conceal it for now. Everything will be fine, trust me. I will, but I just want you to know that I can't spend forever with a drug dealer, a violent man. I can't. My happiness is so sacrosanct to me. I know. I don't want to talk about it. We'll get to know it. We'll get to the root of it. Really, I just don't want to get married to a drug dealer and a violent man. I, I can't take it anymore. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. You don't tell that yet. Yeah. I mean, you don't tell that You can't be serious as to go to that part of your side. If you are a shoot, you do if I wear your shoes, I will do everything within my power. As in, you are going to the police. They are working on me. You mm -hmm. need to as far as soiling your hands. Not soil my hands. I simply wait to let the doctor do my hands. I want to let the doctor do my hands. You see that I'm so and what's the difference between that and what I told you last week, Jimmy? I don't understand. What is this? How? It's something like what? I saw Your son, Timothy, has virtually told me everything in the past without telling me this way. Because he knew that all of you will come to me inquiring, just as you are doing now. And you said virtually, which means there are things he does without telling me. Well, uh, all I know is that I'm going to stop. I'm going to stop. I'm going to stop. Now you are talking like a father that knows his son. Ajumi is a prodigal son. You wouldn't have met any of your properties when you returned from Canada. As simple as that.
So, what did the Reverend Father say? What did that interest? What did that interest? I don't understand. What's going on? Well, I went to see a pregnant mother in the fire man or something. And what did the Reverend say? It's just what Father Mike said. You mean you took our source left to be made for the inquire? You know what you are asking. What other way, what length can one go in search of missing time? What's in your head? I don't understand. You know too well that if our son is here, he will be happy with you. My son gave me no chance. I've done nothing compared to what other families could do in such a permissive time. What? Are you the one who took him to me like this? Honey? from him. Are you hearing me? I said I never expected that from him. I'm not happy about it at all. Because the person in question we're talking about here is my son too. And as a mother, I never thought of him going to a native doctor or any negative places to ask of him because I knew too well that my son is safe. So please, talk senses into him. You need to talk to him. You need to talk to him. I'm not happy about it at all. Thanks, I heard you. Bye.
Your food is here. Yes, Papa. Who are those people? Oh, Papa. Uh, well, some some nice people that I help uh, get their food because I was already ahead of the line. We decided to make my journey easy. Indeed, it is your food. Yes, Papa. Your food is here. Just how you want it. I even told them to keep some extra for me, but you know what I'm saying? Johnny, yeah baby, I'm just thinking, how can such a nice, good-looking guy be doing carpenter with his dad at his age? Um, well, you heard him say he's just um, helping his father out while he's looking for something better. <laughs> My dear, what do you expect? It's not about business. Just doing his business. Yeah. Moreover, is he a graduate or what? Working in an No, oil he's company. a graduate. He said he didn't get job. Oh. Yes. Oh, That's not befitting. He's too cute for that. He's not my business. So, Kim, can you be say that? Oh, the food. Yeah. The truth is, I can't wait to get to the house and taste it. It smells so good. <laughs> the aroma is something else. I know. I can't wait for you to have a taste of this food. You will love it. Ah, food has done me very bad though. So I took out time to, you know, find out where to get this food. So now when you eat it, you will love it. Aww. <laughs> no problems. I'll give you the shirt. <laughs> I pray I like it. You will love it. Let's just get home. I can't wait. I'm so hungry. You're salivating already. I'm telling you. Oh, <laughs> Oh my god, I can't just wait. So believe me, in this life, everything is turn by turn. Okay? And my own turn will come. And I will succeed. Yes. I... I had a great opportunity today, but I couldn't do anything because I didn't want to embarrass myself. And what opportunity are you talking about? Hmm? Timothy, you have been following me up and down since. Now you are done because I asked you a question. Look, I went to the restaurant to get food for my father and I, and I met this girl. She came with her friend, they drove to the restaurant to also get food. So I helped them, and in return, they drove me back to my father's shop. Honestly, that girl is just the kind of girl I want in my life. Hmm? Huh? Are you the one saying this? Why? Timothy, are you the one saying this? What do you mean? Because the Timothy that I know will tell me that he's looking for a good Homely and the God fearing girl. So, how come suddenly you're not having interest with a girl that owns a car? No. There is no harm in dreaming big. I mean, I didn't say, I didn't say there is a harm in dreaming big. Hey, I'm just asking to know if my guy is okay because you are sounding like somebody who is not normal. Joe, take it easy, man. I only shared my thoughts with you. Huh? Uh, why, are you why, why are you fighting me? I'm not fighting you. I'm not fighting you. I'm just trying to make sure if my guy is still on the right track. He must be here, man. Oh, you are taking this thing too seriously. I, I'm not even sure I could see the girl again. Like the day they give me stress. It's all right if I if I fantasize about uh, 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 having a girl like that. I know whether I go see him again. I bet free me. I have the right to think big, even if it's for a moment. Automatically, behind the tire, man. Understand? Oh. Things have been stabilizing since then. It's okay. Oh, it's fine now. And how about cook you told me? Please add my own. I need a very shade one. You know, let me call you back. Why are you laughing at me? Nobody's enjoying any coke. But I heard you mention coke now. Are you trying to deny it? 
you want to eat alone? No, nobody's eating alone. I only asked him to help me get one on her way back home. Uh, hey. That's a man. King's fiancé has sourced another big contract for us. This time is from the federal capital of Nigeria, Abuja. This one thing. <laughs> that is to say we are now controlling the central bank. We will bring the central bank down to this place. <laughs> That's nice. Mm -hmm. I the of God, it will work. Mm -hmm. uh, you know, Ben, he's used to the system. You will only post things and it will come to pass. It has come to pass. So, listen, that is the beauty of having a son in law. He is caring. And he looks after his wife's people. You see, Ben is such a nice young man. That's my basic him. Help me to talk to her. No. Bend down for him. Let him be the man of the house. So that things will continue to flow. He will continue to bless us and God will be using him. God will complete that good work. He started in him. That would be a problem. I'll order for your token. No, please tell her to bring the one, even the one from the mortuary that is so dead. <laughs> Without a cook man. Hey! Trying to mess up my city. Baby, stop. I'm sure of this fact. I'm not messing up anywhere. Okay, I've already bought the things I want to look for, but so I'm finished. I decided to take this last. You see how stupid you are? Lazy brat. You bought stuff you want to cook and then you decided to eat this nonsense in my living room. Why can't you just cook at once? Are you mad? I don't even have anything to eat but this. What is this? You're eating this useless no. biscuit in my house? Are you mad? Are you lost? No. Are you a child? Listen, I am going straight into my room. By the time I come back, I want you to clean this place up. Arrange my room to where it's supposed to be. And mop this place. Am I understood? Baby, baby, for once be romantic. Stop all this. Oh, are you talking back to me? Jesus! Huh? Who romantic help? Oh, really? I can see you love beating. You like me touching you. I said I'm sorry. I said I'm sorry. Come back here. Get me. I'm sorry. Can I ask you again? 
how I know and how is that? I hope you two are doing great. Mom, Ben is there. Ben is there. What do you mean by that? Mom, the truth is, I can't really wait to completely cut off from Ben. I can't do this for the rest of my life. I am tired. Don't say this to the end of your father. Especially now that he's expecting something from Ben. He will win everything. Really? Mom, so it's all about dad and his selfish interest. You all would rather mortgage my happiness for what he's getting from Ben, right? Do you even care about me? My feelings, my happiness, my safety, my security? Do you people care? It's fine. No problems. Um, Mom, where is Frances? I need her to do something for me. Uh -uh. That a lot has been facing you. And you can ask you a lot of things that you don't want to share. So please, whatever that is going on, do not throw everything 
out of your country. You can talk to me, but you don't want to share. Jenny, I'm fine. I don't really see what you want to do. I don't know. You're sick worried about Benjamin, right? Yes, he don't like it. He's written all of it. I can see it. But you know, the world you're going about it is just not good. I know he's not a good man, but the way you're going about it feels like he wants to revenge or something. I mean, he didn't do the same thing He got the message. I am tired. I'm fed up. I deserve better. I deserve true love. I deserve happiness. And Benjamin is not giving any of those to me. And my father wouldn't even see business with me. It's frustrating. I get it. I know. But your mom. You're still with her, right? You can share things with her. I think you should speak to your mom about it. Yes, she will be able to advise you. Baby girl, I don't want you to make any mistakes. But you don't need to ask for tomorrow. If you are not you Please speak to your mom about it. Alright, I'll talk to your mom. Mom, mom, this is wrong. This is wrong. This is pure humiliation and totally uncalled for. The Timothy you're fighting for has brought it with his two hands and full chest. And you're here killing yourself. That's because you didn't have an option. No, tell me, how do I explain this to people? How? You don't owe any explanation to anyone. Timothy made his choice and he's leaving the seat. That's obviously not his choice. You were there. You didn't even ask him more. When dad came to ask for your hand in marriage, was this how your parents treated him? Did they humiliate him to this extent? That's enough. Enough! You need to rest your head before you blow everything out of proportion. I'm what not blowing anything out of proportion, mom, for crying out loud. I'm just stating the obvious. This is pure humiliation. No man deserves to be treated in that manner. Kimberly, just calm down. Like I told you earlier, you need to rest your head. For your father, I will talk to you, okay? Just go in and rest. Mom, talk to your husband. Talk to dad. If nothing is done and done or done, I might do something very nasty that will affect all of us. Talk to him, Mom. I deserve happiness. I deserve to be happy. I haven't done anything wrong. I don't want them because I don't want them. I want Timothy. And no one can make me change my mind. No matter how much you need to for that. Mas, no. Oh, man. It is your so one big head. Moon. You cannot use that head and think of something this level and responsible. That's my wish. It is poor. Is wretched, understood. Living for me is my choice. Love me like that. He is poor, I know. He is wretched, understood. Living for me is my choice. Love me like that. His love is special. He knows my heart, yeah. He gives me joy. He gives me happiness.
Thanks for everything, Kim. You're welcome. Hi. Hello. Kim, that's uh, my friend and host, Joe. Nice to meet you, Joe. Nice to meet you, too. I have to be on my way. Huh? Okay. Kim. Can't you come in for a while? At least you stop by. Um, I'm sorry, I actually have to rush somewhere. Maybe we do this some other time. Some other time? Oh, come on, Kim. It will not take time. Eh? Besides, I don't like it when someone gets to my doorstep and refuses to come in. Come on. Five minutes. Across my heart. Okay? Great. Bad boy. <laughs> this way, please. Thank you. Mm. Um, are you chatting with another man? <laughs> um, imagine now, Thomas, an Arsenal fan, saying that uh, if Arsenal win a prize, I must. But they have won the Premier League. Whereas they still have about 17 matches to go. Can you imagine that? <laughs> they are daydreamers. A very big daydreamer. It is just like Chelsea that are in the position, saying that they will carry the Premier League after 20 matches each. How is that possible? There are 10 matches. <laughs> Isn't that amazing? Because probably they feel they are the only one winning, and others will just sleep and watch them win all the time. I don't know why they, they feel so comfortable. Look, in Premier League, in English Premier League, anything can happen. My friend, well, that's true. Anything can happen when you are up and down. No sitting at the bottom lies at that table. And you expect me that to happen. How is that possible? Um, guys, please, one minute. Let me take this call. Uh, all right. <laughs> yeah, I'm good. I'm at home. In my parents' house. Oh, really? You are at your father's house? Um, I'm, I'm lying down on the couch. Yes, in the sitting room. Oh, you are even at the parlor. Relaxing. Alright. Since you are at your father's place, I mean, I wanted to see you. Um, yes, but can I call you back? But don't stress. All right. I will see you tomorrow. All right. Guys, I'm sorry about that. <laughs> I just had to lie. It's okay. But I have to be on my way. Yeah. Oh. Are you seeing what I was talking about? I mean, can you... Imagine the embarrassment, Chief. I'm here with you in your sitting room, and your daughter, my love, is telling me that she's here also. When I start to react now, they will start saying I'm a bad man. I am this, I am heartless. I'm a woman beater. Is this not an embarrassment to my personality? Benjamin, one of you. No more Malaysia. And someone is toying with my heart. I don't think your daughter knows what it takes for me to pour out my love on her like that. Honestly speaking, Chief, your daughter doesn't know what she's doing. Because I'm a very busy man. You know, 
what I do. You know the amount of money I, I get. And she's just toying with my heart as if I'm a small boy. Can you see? Honestly, I'm short of words. These children, they will never cease to amaze me. I wish the mother is around to see, to see for herself. But, Francis, I hope you heard her clearly. Dad, just like you always say that there is no smoke without fire. What do you mean by that? Maybe she's attending to something very important or close to the house, thinking that you are home. Must she lie to me? Oh, tell me, must she lie to me? That means she doesn't love me. So in, in other words, I'm wasting my precious time. After what I've done for this family, after my investment, you know how I do things, I bring money to you, for you all to be happy. And the woman I love is messing with me. Come on, Chief. You know me too well. Benjamin, one of Europe, is not someone that anybody would just toy with. It's okay. The embarrassment is too much. I dare to take my leave too. I will see you some other time. You are an idiot, a buffoon. Look at what you said before, be, be, before this gentleman. Why don't you? Anyway, I have no business with you until your sister comes back. It's wretched as to live it for me. It's my choice. Love me like that. He is poor. I know. He is wretched as to live him for me. It's my choice. Love me like that. His love is special. Hey, baby girl. You're welcome. Thank you, darling. How are you? Where's mom and dad? They are inside, but the problem is that Benjamin was his father when he was calling him. Oh my god, are you missing? Jesus, Francis. All you have seen is Frances Nightingale. Have you sang for her? That good evening. Oh, good evening. May that evening, may that good evening turn to bad evening for you, idiot. That's a huge cause. You're even on your own child. My daughter, I get it for you, Jesus. Amen. Nothing will happen to you. Amen. Who would have all the wrong she has done? Not to him, cause he's on my own child, your child. It's all right. Maybe I'll go. I will take a flight to get a KFC chicken for her. To congratulate her for lying. Lying to me. Then I'm sorry, but I was close by. <laughs> Why are you chasing them around? Are they your me? This is your two drivers. This is my Maru. No, 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 no. Keep supporting them. Keep supporting them. One day, just one day, the shame, the load of shame she will come back with. You will heap it on your head. God, judge will, your God head. will judge you and I. If you or I are the, is the one raising these children right, what is wrong with you? Why are you talking like that? No, I, I, I don't think that. You want to fall and break your waist. Then you blame them. Oh, God, sorry. You said what? Absolutely sorry. You just said sorry. Is it a crime? Come on, get away. The thunder that was striking is being pressed up in Kaduna. Idiot. Ha! Sir, I'm going to ask that great family. Can you calm down? What is it? What is bringing you? I don't know. I don't know. It's like this. I don't know. It's simple. 
on a wet yet the shiko. Did you tell you that she was poor? He is poor, no. he is wretched, and has to live it for me. It's my choice, love him like that. But of a true Timothy, mm -hmm. I must confess, despite her rich lifestyle, she's still homely and down to earth. I enjoyed her company. I wish she would come again. Kel is just a cool girl. Let's just cross our hearts because I believe that she enjoyed our company too. It's just that she looks like someone that have a rich boyfriend or maybe rich parents. But what matters is happiness. Oh yes, Timothy. You know these rich people, they can go to any length just to find love. They don't even mind going to the dirtiest gutter. Talking about having a boyfriend, if she has a boyfriend, I advise you stay clear. Oh yes, because I don't want somebody coming here to look for us or to start treating our lives. That's the part that I hate so much. How these rich guys intimidate us with their wealth pisses me off. Timothy, the truth of the matter is that if you are in the same position, you might do the same. You will go any length to protect what is yours. Thank God you said might. Hmm? Well, if it is meant to happen, faith will bring us together again. I'm sure about that. She's a nice girl. Wait a minute, Timo. Are you talking about one of those girls that drove you here some time ago? Yes, Papa. I don't know, you know better. But such girls can be good or worse because of their lifestyle. But if she likes you as you claim, then she can volunteer herself and help you chase your dream and your desire. You're right, Papa. But my friend that is watching me think for the while. Um, he likes her. And he said as much as she looks homely and nice, that he's afraid she might be wild and bad because she's from a rich home. <laughs> it's also right. Yes. <laughs> You can proceed with her, or you stay away, as you rightly say. The rich mingles with the rich. Well, Baba, those, those words are in quotes. In reality, the rich are always looking for what money cannot buy. And I know that's what she's searching for. You are equally right. But the choice is for you. Yes, if you make the right choice and you succeed, you share with me. But if it backfires, you equally share with me. But take note, you are the one to bear the consequences alone. You bear it alone. Not with me. But you share the fortune with me, but the Lord you share it with me. How do you do that? Go ahead, Mr. Job. I can see you're doing well. I think I like him. 
no, I'm not joking. I think I'll fall in love the second time. He's, I, I don't know about his personality, his cameras, the way he talks to me. <laughs> see, see, I don't want too much talk of your wisdom. I'm just telling you that I'm now in love with you. I love the way and <coughs> I'll call you back, my dad is in. <coughs> dad, <coughs> I thought you went out or you didn't come back with your car. I came back on time. The car is with the mechanic, he's fixing one or two things there. Yeah. Um, well, Dad, I hope you didn't hear my conversation. I had everything clearly. <laughs> Young love. <laughs> you see, I told you that soon you will start enjoying it. The same thing I told Ben when he came here complaining. <laughs> uh, only God knows how he will feel hearing all these vibes. <laughs> um, Dad, please, I want to ask you for a favor. Do not tell him about this phone conversation. Please, Dad. Okay, there's no problem. I will not tell him. I promise. Thank you, Dad. I, I will you. not tell him. Um, you see, if you continue like this, hey, hey, everything will be settled. You see, you know what we will stand to gain from there? What this family will stand to gain from him? Yes. Where's your mom? Let me call her. She's in the kitchen. Mom? Girlfriend, my dad scared the hell out of me. I didn't even know if he was listening to me. Thank God you can only do it that way yourself. I'm sure. Oh, I'm sure. What? Hey, have you just found out what happened when the father made her to try to cheat from home during the last year? So definitely be like a war between two parents. You don't know your father. Your father was killed. He will kill you. He might even disown you. Yes, because you're trying to cut him off the way he's taking the work of your life. my problem. Yeah, that is what really hurts me the most in front of us. So it's not about who my father cares. Nobody cares about my security. Nobody cares about my feelings. There's no way. Or let me do everything you want. The ones I'm doing now, now we're feeling the most of all the things that you're doing with your best life. So you've got to have a good time. Big man, that's the big man. Big man, that's the big man. He will listen, he will listen. Big man, that's the big man. I was not saying, if you're big man. You have no say Big man turns to big man On the bus here, on the bus here Big man turns to big man He will listen, he will listen Yeah, hello? How are you now? You never come home till now, what did that happen? Oh, not to you know. It's just that Kim has been here twice, asking of you. So I, I was wondering if you don't give up, Bella. <laughs> you, you are not normal. So where are you now? Oh, oh, you went to your father's shop. Oh, okay, okay. I do and come back. Oh. Yes, do and come back. I gave plenty gist for you. My one! <laughs> yes. 
Okay, no. <laughs> One more thing. As you are coming back, help me branch at the Maman Kechi. Buy a very hot akala. With that round bread. Yes, now within our job this night. I have no issue. Come quick, go. Okay. <laughs> My one. Mm. My my my. Whatever that. Don't you get away. You make a fine like American pizza. Baby. Hi, darling. Baby boo. Why are you so excited like you want to love you? Baby boo. My love. <laughs> I am so happy. In fact, I want something bigger than a planet. You've yes. always been a winner. Thank you. Keep winning. Uh huh. So what is this that you want this time around? Um, actually, I don't know how to start telling you this, but I'm happy because this good news I got is something I've been expecting in this our relationship. What could that be? Okay, I got this good news. How you were calling your friends. Telling them how much you love me, how much you care about me. We are just, you know, practically telling your friend that you cannot do it. And I'm so happy to hear that. Oh, with this, I can now say I am really in love with you. Because the love for me is genuine. And I know that you mean it, right? <laughs> we love you so much. Keep this to yourself. You and I know that your dad cannot keep this to you. This is a good news. This is what I want to be there. Huh? I want to be there in this kind of thing. So if I can't that, I love you so much. You know so, that. What do you have to say? I have a lot to say. A lot to show you. So right now, I want to take you inside the room. Take care of you. That's you. Mm -hmm. Can you see? Mm -hmm. Yeah, mm, but that should be later. Wow. <laughs> you need to eat, you just need to go. Come on, you're not worried. Oh, you don't need anything. It's really good. Come on. Huh? You see? I can't stop thinking about it. Let's go to the Oh! So you love me so much. Why can't you just tell me I love you? Huh? Tell me that I want to be here to you every day. My queen! Let me go to the room. It's not like I don't want. But I have a lot of work on the table. So much to do. Look, look around. I'm busy. I totally understand you. But at the same time, you need to rest. Okay? So I'm of the opinion you should go to somewhere cozy, chill over a glass of whatever you so desire and share thoughts. Okay, just give me a moment. Let me round up something. Alright, I'll be waiting. He is poor, I know. He is wretched, understood. Living for me is my choice. Love me like that. He is poor, I know. He is wretched, understood. Living for me is my choice. Love me like that. His love is special. Just look at all she got for me. <laughs> she has transformed my life. Please help me and thank Kim. She's been wonderful to me. Thank you so much. Thank you, Kim. It's as if you knew he really needed to change his wardrobe. Mm -hmm. What are friends for? I mean, if not to help each other when we have needs. It's nothing. And I'm glad I could put a smile on your face. Thank you so much. Look at the way you're smiling. <laughs> <laughs> so, guys, um, it's really nice being here, but I have to be on my way. Ah. Yes. Okay. I'll call you later. All right. No problem. Bye bye. Bye. Take care of yourself. Take care of you. All right. Bye. Bye. Oh boy. <laughs> Look at this. 
so just funny. look just look just look at this joe i am not joking she bought me everything brand new there is more there is look at this man see i'm speechless this thing now, so all these big men that I used to do. Right? Yeah. She's doing all these things so that you can fit into her level. <laughs> you don't look like a village right. boy. <laughs> right? Well, yeah. I'm sure this will even make me fit into her level. Yeah. Well. yeah. Baby girl, I can see the smile all over your face. You look so beautiful and happy. <laughs> so, you love this guy. That's an understatement. <laughs> The fact is, I've fallen heads over him for him. I love him. Ah, yes, he's worthy of it. Though. So, where are you driving at? Um, I think I should help him. He's brilliant. He speaks well. Um, I think you deserve it better. Yes. So, I want to give him some money to start a business. Oh, no. this is charm, right? He's using a charm. I don't ever want it to clear off my eyes because I'm enjoying every bit of it. This is the first time someone is making me to feel really loved, respected, cherished, adored, and appreciated. Okay, yeah. baby girl, listen. I want to make life more comfortable for him. I don't like where he's staying. I don't like where he works. I don't like the kind of business he's doing. So I'll change his mind. Kim. Yeah. You haven't even recovered from Benjamin. And now, this new guy is not Benjamin. Is I just hope you're doing the right thing. And I hope he's worth the stress. Yes, he's worth it. The video times. And then. Okay, I'm happy for you. Please, let's go get some ice cream. I can't wait. Because this sounds so good. <laughs> He is poor, he is wretched, living for me, is my choice, he love me like that. He is poor, he is wretched, living for me, is my choice, he love me like that. Were you able to wait for our son's call? Yes. Uh, when he called, I listened to all the conversation. <sighs> Joe, Kim wants to shock me again. Another shocker is on the way. <laughs> what is she planning this time around? Does she want to buy you a car? No, I don't think I need that right now. That's a liability. I never chop belly food. Mm -hmm. A word. Uh, uh, you are right. So what is she planning to do this time? Guess. I can't guess. Tell me. She wants to start a business for me. Are you serious? I am very serious. As a matter of fact, you and I are going to the market so that, you know, I can survey and see the kind of business I'll get involved in. Hey, yes. Wow. <laughs> Timothy, listen. Mm -hmm. Right here, right now. Yes, my brother. I do not care whatever anybody have to say mm -hmm. concerning you and Kim. I hear you. Hold that gear with your two hands. I hear you. Timothy, <laughs> hold that gear with your two hands. Look, man, it feels like I'm watching a movie. Hey! I can't stop watching it. My guy, don't make a move. <laughs> you are not in this car. You catch yes, this one, <laughs> Wait. 
Okay. <laughs> Hello, darling. He is poor. He is wretched. Understood. Living for me is my choice. Why are you staring at me like that, Mom? Is there any problem? King, I am your mother. Remember, we still cook and eat from the same pot as a family. There's something you're not telling me of late. Especially this is your newfound joy. I don't want to believe it's been like your father has always said. I don't trust him on that. Can you please tell me the secret? Uh, no. I'll tell you. Can we not talk about it right now? Really? Is that how you want to do this, your new dance? Remember. You will come looking for me when the time comes. And you don't want us to talk about it now. What do you want us to talk about? I'm sorry, sorry. Can I take my He is poor. He is wretched. Understood. Living for me is my choice. Loving like that. He is poor. He is wretched. Understood. Okay, so we have a big provision store, electronics. Clothes and shoes. So, amongst these three, which do you think you would thrive with? Don't look at me. Timothy, the ball is in your court now, so play it. She's asking you. I don't know which one I should pick. I'm confused. Help me out. They're all good businesses, but I just don't know the right one to pick. Electronics have a big provision. And, and the thing is that the king, I will place this for you to choose. Because uh, you are the one that is going to fund it. So I suggest you pick according to your pocket. Money is not the problem. Uh -huh. Yes, I just want us to pick a business he will be passionate about. Electronics. So, okay, electronics. Yes, yes. <laughs> because. This one has to do with everyday, you know, items that people need. And, and, and it will fit a big shop, you know. Yes. Electronics, lots of electronics. I totally agree with you. Yes. <laughs> okay, so we'll do electronics. But yeah, first thing first, we need to get someone tomorrow that will help you out with the shop and other things you need. Sure, sure. I will need that help. That's okay. Thank you so much. Don't Thank mention. you so much. Can't believe Don't this. Ah, yeah, you got sent to me. I want to know. It's okay. You're yeah, really a got sent. <laughs> it's okay. So we'll discard this too. Yeah, no, yes. yes, exactly. Electronics, exit. Mm. Yes, this is the right choice. And I guess I should be thinking about the brands that I will have to deal with. Of course, you'll get variety. Do you have a suggestion of brands? So, Timothy, because of that girl, Kim. You have not been coming to the workshop for the past three years. What is going on? There's something good has been going on. I've actually been learning electronics business, electronics trade in the market. Electronics? Yes. Are you telling me the truth? That's the business Kim is helping me to set up. She wants to open a big electronics shop for me. She you? Yes. If that is what is going on, that's a very good news. Of course. But I hope you are learning very well. Ah, but I'm learning very fast. In fact, in fact, by next week, I will be buying my own set of goods, the first set of goods, and opening my shop, Papa. Oh, this, yes. is, this is good. Yes, Papa. I would like you to come along with her, so that I will thank her myself, because she is doing a very great job, very great job she has done. And I pray that God will continue to reward her. Amen. That is it. Amen. Oh, that is very Amen. good news. Good news. Good news. I hope the work is going well here. Very, very, very well. <laughs>
Come in. Who is there? Come inside. Come down, is a hospital. Oh, Hi, mommy. Good evening. Good evening. Baby, how are you? Good evening. Good evening. Thank you. Good day, sir. This is my mother. This is my father. Dad, mom. This is. Timothy and this is Joe, they are my friends. Oh, Hello, how are you? I think at this point we'll be there. Okay, oh, yeah. oh, bye, excuse you. <laughs> I'll see you later. Right, Jenny, how is the people? <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> this huge man. <laughs> <laughs> 